Hello and welcome to Glitch Tech X. Thank you so much for tuning in today. Thank you for your time. How have you been? I welcome you back to another episode of Motorsports Manager. We are starting off with season two. Uh, we finished season one, uh, last Grand Prix in the previous episode. I'll put a link in the description. Uh, you may go ahead and watch that uh, season after you've watched this video. Uh, all right, but uh, before we continue, a recap of the previous season. Uh, we started from the bottom, now we're here. <laughs> we started with the shoddy team and HQ, a subpar car, and we were constantly finishing at the end of the pack. Uh, we did have a few races where we finished in the midfield, but those were rarest of the rare occurrences. Uh, we were losing money every GP. Uh, we built a lot of parts in the previous season, we had we had to work on the car as it needed considerable upgrades to be competitive. We also upgraded the HQ in the previous episode, i.e. episode number 10. Uh, go ahead and watch the previous season after you've watched this video. Now I am back with another episode of uh, Motorsports Manager. We have started season 2 now and in this episode, we'll focus on setting our goal for the season, building the car from the ground up, tweaking the driver lineup as well as finalizing the livery of the cars. So let's go, let's buckle up and let's floor it. So I just went through uh, the mail items. Uh, now I am just reviewing the pitch crew members. All right, so the car repair is finished. All right, so we sent out a couple of contract proposals to uh, three drivers in the previous episode. Um, we sent one to Jose. We wanted to renew the contract with our reserve driver, uh, as well as we sent a couple of uh, proposals to uh, two new drivers. So uh, it seems that Jose has accepted our contract. That is great. Uh, we will sign him in. Our reserve driver has been locked in. Uh, we're just waiting for uh, the answers to our contract proposals. All right, so uh, we are going to get our prize money for the for season one. Uh, Ten point nine million dollars. That is great. Uh, we need the money, and. Uh, Okay, uh, great. Uh, manager of the season has been decided. And the driver of the season has been decided as well. That is great. Kudos, guys. Congratulations. All right, so uh, the rules that we voted on uh, in the previous season are in effect now. Uh, we are replacing uh, Tondela track C with uh, track B. And we are also doing away with the bonus points for... Uh, pole position uh, qualification. A few teams have uh, been promoted to uh, Tier 2, Formula 2, and a few teams have been demoted uh, to Formula 3 from uh, Formula 2. All right, Faith. Uh, see you, Lassie. Uh, you're retiring now. Yeah, it was my bad. I kind of pushed you towards the uh, the media front. Uh, you were a great driver. Thank you for your service. So Anna is not happy with uh, the contract terms. So I am going to line up... Uh, Scouting jobs. I'm going to start scouting for new drivers, new talent. Uh, we still have a few months left uh, before the first Grand Prix of Season 2. So let's scout new talent. 
let's see if if we can uh, uh, let's see if we can uh, onboard uh, new drivers. Okay, uh, let's see if this uh, this proposal cuts it. Yeah, Sarah is not happy with the numbers uh, as well. Again, adjusted the contract terms uh, with Sarah. Let's see uh, what she has to say about it now. All right, so we need to work on this year's uh, car chassis. Uh, we're getting seven million from uh, the chairman. And now I am going to uh, select the engine supplier, the fuel supplier, the chassis material supplier, as well as the brake supplier. So I'm going to take my sweet time to decide uh, the various uh, part suppliers uh, because uh, we won't be able to change these. Uh, uh, we won't be able to change our partners once we start uh, the season, once we finalize this. So, yeah, and I also need to keep a lookout on the amount of money we're spending on this car. And just going through the list again, uh, trying to be as cost effective as I can be. Kind of uh, dicey about uh, the brake supplier over here. Uh, 3.5 million is a teeny tiny bit uh, on the higher side. All right, so all of these suppliers have been locked down. We spent around uh, 10.7 million on uh, this year's car. Uh, I guess uh, that'll be a good investment because uh, you know we need uh, the best bank for our buck, and we need uh, good suppliers in order to uh, create better parts, design better parts, uh, so that the car can uh, perform better on track. All right, so that's a no from Sarah. That is fine. Now let's uh, see if uh, Shen Ki, I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly is uh, interested in uh, working with us 
Uh, she has uh, decent stats, a two-star driver with uh, a lot of room for improvement. All right, so I've sent uh, the contract terms to Shen. Let's see what she has to say about this. Yeah, I mean, if uh, Anna and uh, Shen, they both sign up with us, uh, we'll have uh, an all-female driver lineup. Uh, that, that, that's great. How's that for women empowerment? <laughs> Oh, that is great. Anna has accepted the contract terms. We will sign her in. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to replace Andre here. All right, so one driver hired. Anna is on board Glitch Nation Motorsports. All right, awesome. Shen has also accepted uh, the contract terms. I'm going to onboard her with uh, our team. Yeah, let's sign the paperwork. Awesome. So we've got an all-female tribal lineup. Uh, Shen and Anna. That is great. So, um, yeah, I hope, uh, I hope this season will be better than the previous one. Uh, we've got a decent tribal lineup with uh, great room for improvement. Okay, what's this? Uh, some small adjustments. Uh, okay, we've been uh, looking at the placement of the new fuel tank. Okay, so we can increase the improvability at the cost of fuel efficiency. I'll go for it. Uh, we've got a plethora of mail right now. I'm just uh, going to quickly skim through these uh, mail uh, items. Okay, uh, decent driver, but we've already signed, uh, we've already finalized our driver lineup. So um, you're a teeny tiny bit late, or maybe I just jump, jump the gun on this. But uh, anyhow, um, I'm hoping for the best. Uh, decent headroom for improvement for Giannis as well. Uh, great talent out there. Oh, okay. Um, Whitney has already been uh, scooped up by Montpella Motorsports. No worries. Okay, uh, tire simulation. Um, an email from our lead designer. Uh, 2.5 million to increase uh, a point in tire wear. Not right now, not right now. We'll uh, we'll see what we can do in the factory and when we design new parts. But uh, two point five million is kind of on the higher side, and we've got uh, two more contract offers. Uh, sorry, sponsor offers. Let's see which deal is the best. Now this looks good.
All right, this is great. Uh, Shen is Shen is refocused. I mean, if a two-star driver is a low-quality driver, uh, yeah, we've already finalized our driver lineup. Okay, wow, this this guy looks uh, promising. Signed up for Octane Racing. Break supplier breakthrough. Um, Tire heating plus one. No, it is too expensive. 2.5 million again. Um, we just have around 12 million to last us uh, this season. Um, plus, I'm pretty sure that uh, we'll be in the negative uh, for the majority of the races this season as well. So I want to, I want to have uh, a decent buffer so that we don't go under. Okay, now we need to finalize the library of the car. Yeah, I kind of like this uh, this library. Yeah, let's uh, tweak the colors a bit. Yeah, Ferrari red. Yeah, this looks good. Nice bright uh, colors. Yeah, our competitors would definitely know that uh, we're in the rear view mirror. And then we'll pass them in a jiffy. That's the objective. That's the dream, yeah. Awesome, yeah, I kind of like the new colors. I like the new library. Okay, great. Preseason testing this weekend. So we need to test our car. It is almost time to hit the track. All right, preseason testing is about to begin. Let's go. Let's start the testing. Anna is 10th. Great, great. Okay, awesome. Anna is 13th. But uh, Shen is 20th uh, with an oil leak. Okay. Um, 
kind of kind of disturbing but uh, let's see uh, i mean there's a huge gap between both the cars uh anna finished in uh, 13th and uh, shen finished in 20th but uh, let's see hopefully uh, once we start working on the car over the course of the season we'll be able to bridge that gap and we will come out victorious that is the objective here So what I'm trying to do right now is uh, trying to change uh, the team outfit, uh, but it seems that I don't have any, there is no option to change that. I have uh, no way to change that because I kind of wanted uh, the team outfit to be um, red this season uh, to match the car, but uh, it seems that uh, there is no way to do that. Anywho. Uh, onwards and upwards. We are waiting for uh, the HQ to be built or rather upgraded. So so this staff lineup is uh, still with us for another 22 months. That is uh, good. At least I'm relaxed from this uh, front. Uh, Preseason testing report. Okay, Anna was 13th. Uh, Shen finished 20th. Uh, I'm happy to report that we're in strong position. That is good. That is good. Uh, okay, we now need to finalize our target of the season. Um, we kind of uh, selected 10th in the previous season because uh, we were a new team. But I am trying to uh, but I will up the ante and I will select 8th uh, as the final uh, season finish, as the goal for this season. I'll be a bit aggressive with this goal because uh, yeah, we finished 10th in the previous season and I want to do better than this. I want our team to do better than this. So hopefully 8th we will be able to meet with uh, our objective. But uh, that is something that uh, we'll see in the episodes to come. Okay, great. Uh, it's a baby girl for Jose. Uh, congratulations, man. Uh, you just uh, got married in the previous season, uh, maybe a couple of episodes ago, and now you've got a baby girl. Great. Uh, all right, upcoming uh, lap report, or rather a race report. Uh, 18 lap race uh, with a lap length of 2.6 miles, and again, 40% chance of rain. Yeah, we don't have a forecasting center. Maybe that's why it's either 40% or 10%. Um, yeah, but uh, anyway, we'll wing it. Uh, the lead designer is asking for a brakes research facility. Uh, let's see. Let's see. We will, uh, uh, we will think about that. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. We are going to aim for a hugely impressive uh, result this season. We are going to gear up for Black Sea GP. And we'll do that in the next episode. I'll see you guys in the next episode for the first Grand Prix of Season 2. Uh, Black Sea Grand Prix. Uh, that's it for this episode. Uh, we've set up the car. We've set up the library. We've set up the team. We've finalized uh, the driver lineup. Thank you so much for your time today. And thank you so, so much to everyone who watched the video till the end. Um, I'll see you in the next video. Uh, do subscribe to the channel. I need your love and support. Uh, do like the video if you want to see more of Motorsports Manager. Thank you for your time. I'll see you in the next video. Bye for now.